trainer Peter John Parsad. Trainer, you have two fillies in the 10 furlong Jamaica Oaks on Saturday, August 3, 2024. Blue sensation and ammo. How have they prepared for this race? So I'm very, very happy with, with how both of them have prepared. In particular, Blue Sensation, she has had a good prep run into the race. She's a horse that every race she's run, she's done better and better and better. We had her as a classic horse from really the first race she ran. We knew she wanted to go long. We always had it in the back of our mind that she would be an eventual Oaks horse. And, you know, leading in here now, coming off of a win, we know that she's going to want to stay and we've seen about a two second improvement in her last race, seven for a long time. So we're very, very pleased with that. She had an unfortunate race in the, in the Guineas that we, we think we know what was the cause of a poor performance. Uh, so when we brought her back and she ran a fantastic race against Colts and foreigners in a three-year-old, none, two and one, we're very pleased. So I'm, I'm excited to see what she'll do. We're very, very confident and we're really looking out for a very, very progressive run from her. Um, Amma, we had very high expectations of her as well. I think if things were a little different in the Guineas, I think she'd have really put in a shake when it came to the finish. And unfortunately for her, when she came back, she had some problems in the gate and it just, a lot of things set up in that comeback race that didn't work out the best for her. But she's come on since then and she's trained fantastic. I have one of the best classic riders in Jamaican history on her in Shane Ellis. And then I think I have the best current classic jockey in terms of active young jockeys in Ryan Lewis and Blue Sensation. So the horses have done well, we're confident in the jockeys and the staff has done a fantastic job with them and you we're know, excited to see what they'll do. Based on what you have just said, it, it, it appears that you're giving Blue Sensation the edge over Amma. Blue Sensation has a lot less question marks because she's come back and she has run a fantastic race and she just, she's done everything we've asked her to do. Amma, you have some question marks there coming out of what we thought was a potentially good race in the Guineas that, I mean, she ran fifth, but we thought she could have run second. But then she came back in a race, we expected her to win and had a lot of challenges in the race. So we think, I'd put it like this, I think Amma is a better horse than Blue Sensation overall, but I think Blue Sensation just is, she, she's bomb proof. She hardly has any issues, a hard trying horse, and you know she's gonna give it her all. Can you describe how pleased you were, if you were pleased with the last two gallops by your two fillies? Sure, I think I'll start with Blue Sensation. I think she's worked absolutely fantastic. Her second to last work, she did a beautiful mile gallop. And what's important for me, um, for my horses heading into these big races, especially longer races, is I want every furlong to be a little better. So I like to see horses with kick, with change of pace, with change of gear, and finishing their work strong. And honestly, Blue Sensation set off good, maintained the pace, she was able to increase at the half mile, and she was able to come home very strong and gallop out very strong. For Amma, uh, same thing with her. The jockey in Shane Ellis, who I think is one of the best jockeys to work with to prepare hours for the race, got her to do exactly what we wanted her to furlong to furlong for all of the work. So she strode a mile as well and galloped out beautifully way around, around you know, six, five furlong range. So, you know, she, she really, both of them are showing us that they're happy. Both of them are showing us that, um, that they'll stay. Both of us are showing, showing us multiple turns of foot in, in the works and it's something that the jockeys are happy with and in turn I'm very happy with. The final gallops for them, Blue Sensation was a little more comfortable. That is by design from me. Same thing with Amma, just a little more comfortable in the, in the easy six for a long stride up with a good finish. You know, I'm a big gallop out person for those, for those works. So if you're going a 14 pace right through, if you can carry that 14 pace around to the five, I know that your, your wind is well and if you come back and you're blowing comfortably, I know that you're set up to, to be fit enough to run a good race. Um, they're both fillies, which I think is, is very important. So people looking at the preparation and expecting to see these big, fast, blasting times, I personally don't think that 
that's the best kind of works for Phillies to get going into these races. They've had hard campaigns, um, they're fit, they're happy, and I think that they got a nice little finish up going into the race and the work is done. So it's up to them now to just, up to us to keep them happy and up to them to go and run. Trainer, all the best in the Jamaica Oaks and if you co come out successful, you'll be f the first from the last match of trainee trainers yes. to actually win a classic race. But to participate in a classic race so early after graduating must be a massive plus. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, almost a dream come true to have these horses. I had a horse that was able to run in the classics last year. That's bootylicious. I think my inexperience and I'd say desire to win the race made me make some mistakes with her that I've made sure that I didn't make back with these horses. So it's, it's going to be a learning process, but I tell you, I, I think um, it couldn't have gone better so far, so hopefully we can get the job done. Thank you, Trainer. All right, thank you. Thank you for watching another video produced by the team from quickgallopjaya.com and its YouTube channel, The Quick Galloper. Please stay on the channel for other enlightening videos on those involved in local horse racing. Please like, subscribe, and press the notification bell.